Prozac use during pregnancy linked to birth problems. Pregnant women who take Prozac for depression during the third trimester have an increased risk of birth complications. A study published in the New England Journal of Medicine found that significantly higher percentages of women who actually took Prozac during the last three months of pregnancy delivered premature babies more frequently as compared to women who didn't take that drug. Similarly, full-term babies born to mothers with Prozac were more likely to be admitted for special care nursery problems. Such complications occurred less frequently for women who took Prozac earlier in their pregnancy and not the third trimester. Study results did confirm early reports that drug dose not contributed to spontaneous abortions or major birth defect defects were actually documented. However, the higher the normal incidence of several minor birth defects is reported for mothers who use the drug during early stages of pregnancy. So possibly it's not a time to actually use this drug. Dr. Goldstein actually mentions that the Prozac itself, like any drug, should not be used during pregnancy only when it's clearly needed. Prozac is like any other drug and should only be taken during pregnancy if you absolutely have to. This is an easy way of saying for the company, we don't accept responsibility for these side effects. And we saw this in this article also of them trying to actually defend themselves for what actually occurs here. And interesting, it wasn't made um, clear to many of the mothers that were put on it that this is an issue. You are important. You're important to us at secondopinion.org. And that's why we bring this type of quality information to you. And if you know somebody on it right now, get to them, at least let them know the facts so they can make a decision that might be best for them and their baby and their family. This is Dr. Benzinger on Health with secondopinion.org. We'll look for you next time and may God bless you.